Hi guys, uh, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Um, in this this um, video, I'm just going to show installing elements of the Product Design Suite Ultimate um, 2015 into Windows 10. I'm specifically going to be installing Inventor 2015 and Vault Basic 2015. So let's see how it goes. Um, I'll just take the basic standalone um, installation with a 30 day trial. There's nothing else installed on this in Windows here at the moment. It's a brand new install, fresh out the box as it were. So we'll just skip ahead. Okay, so now we've got to the product selection. I'm going to deselect everything I don't want. I'm just, just leaving behind Inventor. Um, and I'm not going to install any of the content libraries. I just want to keep this down, keep this to the bare minimum. Um, and don't want that. We do want the Vault Basic client, and we'll just check to see if there are any updates. I'm going to turn off all of this stuff and download that update. All right, now that's done. We'll just check to see if there's any updates for Vault Basic. There are none. And we're all hunky dory and ready to go. Alright, we'll just skip ahead to uh, the end of this installation here. Okay, so there we have it. Um, they've all installed okay, so let's take it for a spin. So the first thing I want to do here, I'm, I'm actually going to log into Vault and um, grab some files and see if they open up okay. I love the new Windows 10 interface, just this flat flat UI with just a slight slight drop shadow. It's uh, it's pretty styly. I'll just switch over to um, the Vault client. I need to grab the Inventor project file and get that downloaded into my um, working folder. Once that's done, I can open up some files from within. Inventor from Vault. Don't know, it's all good. Okay. Getting started, projects, select browse, and we'll jump over to that Vault Basic folder and load up the. Yeah, why not? That's fine. Okay. Now the open button's available on the Vault tab. We can. Uh, Browse for some files and see how they look. Just open the whole lot as read only. Nope, that's fine. Alright, let's take a look at the Vault browser. Everything looks okay. So it's saying it's checked out. We want to just change the size of those icons so they're a bit bigger easier to see okay and just create a new file oh, there's no template so we'll just grab some template files a second download those now we'll have some have some templates here again we'll just switch over to the vault browser and we can see that these are the icons that are in place make some uh, we'll just create a quick sketch a minute. Just some basic geometry. We'll extrude that and smash a hole in it. And check it into Vault. Okay. So that's it, Vault Basic and Inventor 2015 working just fine on um, Windows 10. All right, well, thanks for uh, thanks for listening, uh, or watching rather, and um, take care, have a good day, and see you next time.